Logan was such a roller coaster ride. I think they got a lot of things right about the film. It was interesting to watch Hugh Jackman struggle with his aging body to be a chauffeur uh, for a limo service and trying to save up money to buy a yacht. He and uh, Patrick Stewart are the only ones left. Uh, there have been no mutants for quite a few years. There's also a, a lab which is up to some bad stuff, isn't there always? And trouble, I mean, these worlds collide. Trouble finds Logan, or let's say uh, Logan finds Trouble. There's also a young girl, uh, Daphne Keane, who pretty much is the star of the film. I, I think she stole uh, Hugh Jackman's thunder throughout. It was simply amazing to watch her in action. Great action sequences, some excellent questions. I mean, there's this one sequence where they, where they find a house which is safe. And Patrick Stewart comments on how peaceful he felt at that place. And the irony is that that house as well was anything but safe. So is there really safety or any, any place safe left on planet Earth? And I think that was a really valid question raised. There's... Uh, like a very interesting plot, uh, I would say predictable, but interesting, so keeps you gripped. It's not a constant action kind of film. Uh, there's Boyd Holbrook who's playing the bad action guy, there's Richard E. Grant playing the mad scientist, and apart from them, the film pretty much belongs to Hugh Jackman, Patrick, and Daphne, the three of, the three of them. Great film. Really enjoyable, and I think a fitting end to the Wolverine Logan series. So, well done Marvel. Uh, looking forward to more stuff from Marvel in the near future.